According to the Daily Mail, the Daredevil actor spent his weekend with Lindsay Shukus. They were spotted enjoying lunch with a few friends in Santa Monica, and then Ben headed to church with his ex-wife and children. The Wakefield actress looked both simple and beautiful in her black dress, minimal jewelry, and low-heel sandals, while the Justice League actor looked handsome in his red shirt and blue jeans. The stars showed off beaming smiles as they chatted with their children. Affleck's relationship with Shukas is moving at lightning speed, but Jennifer is concerned about the future of her children. She wants to keep the Saturday Night Live producer away from her family. When the Armageddon star introduced Lindsay to his children, Garner put her foot down and said it's too early for her kids to meet her. An insider reveals that the actress does not want a stepmom for her kids. It's not the first time when Ben Affleck and Jennifer Garner have brought their children to church. They were previously spotted heading to an Easter church with their children and a few friends, the Mirror reported. Garner stunned on the day out in a blue outfit and high heels, while Affleck entered the church in his white shirt and blue jeans. It looks like they are determined to keep things amicable. The exes are focusing on the education and health of their children. In addition, they have asked for physical and legal custody of Violet, Serafina, and Samuel. Garner and Affleck established a friendship on the set of Pearl Harbor. They worked together in Daredevil in 2003 and announced their marriage two years later. The stars filed for a divorce in April of 2017, but their personal issues did not stop them from being good friends. The announcement of their separation came after Affleck completed his residential rehabilitation session for drug abuse. As of now, Jennifer is not thinking about dating, as she wants to spend time with her children and other family members. However, Ben Affleck admits that he is in a serious relationship with Lindsay Shukus.